What's up, guys? Tis Pixel Bullet 2003, and today we're going to be doing a slightly quicker unboxing of a Razer Death Adder V2. Just because I kind of got one, and I was like, screw it, because I was handed a free laptop, I guess you can say, a free Windows 11. And so I tried gaming on it, and I guess all I can say is I kind of would like a mouse anyways, despite not being able to game too much on it. Um, and, and in case you're wondering, it's a Dell Inspiron 7472. Uh, running with 16 gigabytes of RAM, a 4-core Intel i7, 8550U, um, 8th gen by the way, and then there's 500 gigabytes of storage in that motherfucker. So I guess conclude your own judgment, um, but it's running a GeForce MX150, which is supposed to be, I guess, a really poor chip. I guess it's just supposed to be just a mobile chip. But uh, ironically enough, it runs Modern Warfare on like the most potato quality settings. And so that's the only reason why I got this is because I'm here to test how potato Modern Warfare actually is. So without further ado, let's bust this sucker open. Allow me to just... All the tape's gone now. In case y'all just want to read that, I'm pretty sure you know exactly what it is, but just in case if you want to read it, here it is. And I guess this is practically the only... Yeah, it, it comes with the little thank you note for purchasing the thing and then the user manual. Manual, excuse me. I'm a little tired and burnt out from work today, my bad. Anyway, let's get this sucker out of here. Um, it's cable is going to be sitting down there. However, I'm actually wondering how the hell am I going to get it out? Fuck. Okay. Hang on. Wait, got it. Safe and sound fellas. So I guess the only other thing in the box is just this freaking mouse. However, however, how can I wait? Hang on. This is a bit of a puzzle for me. I don't feel like putting too much brain power into this, but if I have to, then fine, so be it. So, uh, fucking motherfucker. Okay. This is kind of, what in the hell? What in the motherfuck? What? Ah, <laughs> oh, that's funny shit. Okay, after a while, I figured out that you just pull this the whole plastic thing and then just kind of whoop, just like that. Take the plastic cover off, take the mouse out, take the cardboard, toss it somewhere, and there you have it. Here is your Death Adder Elite. It's a sick little piece, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, for being just like 42 bucks, goddamn. This actually ain't too bad at all. And the cable's actually kinda nice too. It's got its own little adjuster thing right there. Got a little adjuster band just in case. And then the whole entire cord is just weaved together. And check this out. It's also got a little cover for that right there. So that's chillin'. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, no, I am going to go have fun with this thing, and I will tell you guys how this is, maybe, uh, I don't know, I already have a lot of unboxings due for reviews anyway, like one of them, for example, is the Sony WF-1000XM4s, and then the other one is the UE Mega Boom 3, um, actually the UE Mega Boom 3s, four of them, uh, and then... I think I got one other thing for review other than this, but I'll have to I'll have to check back later. No, but anyway, last procedure you're gonna have to perform is just some plastic tear away. So I guess there you have it. Yeah, I'm gonna go test this thing out now. Uh, I'll try to give you guys an opinion if I can. But yeah, no, so far this thing actually feels kind of nice, even for being cheap and lightweight plastic. It actually feels okay. But yeah, no. All you get is the mouse, some paper, a piece of plastic, some cardboard, and that's it. All right, well, uh, thank you very much for watching this, even though it was only five minutes, and I will catch you in whichever video I choose to publish next. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.